Welcome to the Dorman Products installation video for the intake manifold for General Motors vehicles equipped with a 1.4-liter Ecotec four-cylinder engine. This installation is considered medium and should take around two hours to perform. Before you begin, you should also check this engine's valve cover for damage to the diaphragm located within the PCV cap. The intake manifold and valve cover failures are often directly related, and it will save repair time if you replace a damaged valve cover while the intake manifold is off. Dorman's part number 264-968 is a direct replacement valve cover for this repair. Start by removing the valve cover trim. On the back side of the engine, disconnect the fuel supply line, the wiring harness for the turbocharger wastegate solenoid valve, and the connections for the EVAP purge valve and other components, moving the harness out of the way for clearance. Carefully unplug the fuel injector wiring harness at each injector. Remove the intake hose from the air box, then disconnect the electrical harness at the throttle body. Remove the bolts securing the intake manifold to the cylinder head, Then disconnect the vacuum line from the solenoid on the back of the manifold. Detach the heater hose retainer from the intake manifold. Then lift the manifold assembly off the engine. Unbolt the throttle body from the intake manifold. Remove the screws securing the fuel rail to the manifold and carefully remove the fuel rail. Remove the MAP sensor from the original manifold and transfer it to the new one. Connect its vacuum lines in place. While the injectors are out, remove the old O-rings and replace them with new ones included in the kit. Press the fuel rail into the new manifold, then screw the rail securely in place. Reinstall the throttle body using the new gasket provided. Install the new manifold, starting each of the bolts by hand before torquing them to factory specs. Reassemble the rest of the components in the reverse order of disassembly, making sure to double-check all electrical and mechanical fittings before starting the vehicle. 